Dear friends, I am delighted to join such a distinguished panel and to share my own best wishes on this wonderful occasion. The establishment of the Miltiadis Marinakis Endowed Professorship for Modern Greek Language and Culture at the Ohio State University and the appointment of its first professor, Yorgos Anagnostou, is supremely indicative of our theme today. Both cultural and educational advancement are quintessential characteristics of both Greeks and Greek Americans. We have been the Western world's teachers for millennia. Whether Empedocles or Socrates, Aeschylus or Euripides, Hippocrates or Pericles, every aspect of human endeavor has been pioneered by the Greeks. Therefore, we should proudly celebrate the ongoing commitment of Greeks, both in the motherland and in the diaspora, to the promotion and advancement of our values, cultural, linguistic, ethical, and indeed spiritual. The spiritual values of Greece are the bridge between the exceptional aspirations of the Greek philosophical mind and the preaching of the gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ, which first came about in the Greek language. We cannot separate Greek culture from the Greek language, for the latter is the vehicle that conveys the former. Moreover, as Greek Orthodox Christians, we bear the awesome responsibility of safeguarding and preserving the very language of the New Testament. This language of the New Testament became the language of the liturgy and of the theology of the Church, which, as the Apostle says, is the pillar and ground of truth. Therefore, our grateful celebration of the establishment of the Miltiadis Marinakis Chair is more than a local cause for joy of the Ohio State University. It is a cause for rejoicing across the diaspora, for it bears witness to the commitment of our Laos, of our people, to the never-ending pursuit of truth which is the very nature of the Greek soul. My friends, today's theme is not only of the moment, it is of eternity. For each of us must realize that, especially as Greeks, our lives are part of something much larger than our individual circumstances and accomplishments. We reside in this world, not only to enjoy its benefits, but to be beneficial to others, to pass on monumental legacy of Greece to our progeny and to the world. By promoting and sponsoring endeavors of education and culture, we inscribe our names not into man-made monuments, but indelibly into the history of the world. The generations yet to be born will show their gratitude by etching the values of Greece into their own lives. Thus, will the seeds you plant today bear fruit for the ages? I extend my congratulations to all with a wish that today's convocation become a shining example that will be followed by many, many more to come. Thank you and I wish you all a blessed Pascha.